you'll find that when you've been using Teams for a while, the display can get quite cluttered. There's lots going on. And it's important to keep the information and what you work on daily clear and concise and where you need it. So on the left here, I've got a number of Teams channels. Now, I only use a couple of these on a day-to-day -day basis. So what I'm going to do here, Finance. I don't use Finance daily. So I'm going to click on the three dots here, and I'm going to click on Hide. Now, what that will do is it will hide that channel out of view, but it's still available to me should I need it moving forward. Likewise, Projects, I'm going to click Hide. Now, I'm left with three teams here. Sales, I perhaps use the most. So what I'm able to do is click on sales and drag it to the top. And introduction to teams is second. I might use help desk a little bit more frequently than introduction to teams. So I'm going to drag that up here. So I've put these in the order that I want. The display is much more clear now. Now these are the channels within the teams. So finance, Leeds office, London office. London office I don't use so frequently. So I'm going to hide this now these are the hidden channels here so you can see london office has disappeared it's now within hidden channels finance i'm going to click show and leads office i'm going to click hide so you'll see here i've got the hidden channels below so i can always re view them should i want and there's a hidden hidden teams here so if there's one i need access to backups for example i can click on the ellipsis and click show and now that moves to the top of the screen and it's in view where i need it so that is how to organize your teams and make the view workable for you